right, here we are. It's called Name That Theater. And it's mostly L.A. theaters. And, you know, they've already told me that they're maybe not so good at this. So, uh, <laughs> I mean, uh, Sam's only been here for two years. I don't know what Alicia's <laughs> excuse is. She's been here for a while. <laughs> you might find that you're good at it. But anybody in the chat room that can help out, you, know, you have to do it fast, though, because the, there's such a delay. But there's the first one. Theater of Known. Yay. Oh, yay. <laughs> so it's tied. I think you said that at the same time. That's Theater of Note. So you get the game, right? Theater of Note. There it is. All right. So now the next one. This one should be kind of easy. Is that um, the Kirk Douglas? Oh, that's the, yes, Kirk Douglas. Sorry. Kirk Douglas Theater. Say. Now, wait, who said it first? Sam did, right? She did. Sam did. <laughs> Sam. So Sam's winning, I think. I have Kirk to say Douglas I'm terrible Sam. with names as well. Oh. <laughs> I'm bad with names too. I'm great with theater names though. How about this one? That's not the Broadwater, is it? No, that's not Broadwater. What is that? Uh, now they're uh, delayed, the so blank? they all know. It's yeah. not the blank. I just saw Dan Wingard's here. Hey, Dan Wingard. Maybe you can school KDT. them on what theater this is. Oh, I don't know what KDT is. Oh, that was Kirk Douglas, Douglas Theater. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Everybody, you know, abbreviations, because they're typing, blogging, you know, no, some of them are on their phones. Too. <laughs> well, that's not the blank. That's okay, I'm still sure. waiting for somebody to chime in on this one. Oh. It's not the actors. <laughs> Matt Wright says the rusty triangle. <laughs> <laughs> Dan Wingard, <laughs> long, not long time no see. It's great to see you. I hear that you're fantastic in the musical, the musical that never came out. He was brilliant. He was so <laughs> good. He was our Mr. Mayor, and he was just perfect. Oh, wow. I, I, well, the world missed something. It's great Daniel to reconnect COVID. with, and you know, maybe that'll come up in the future, right? You got that in your back pocket, right? Susical the musical. <laughs> um, you never know. And I he blushes. Check that out. <laughs> Blushing. Um, all right, Skylight Whoa. Theater. We finally have the right answer oh, from Jen Generation. Nice. Okay, so yes, that is the Skylight Theater. Read to the bookshop view. Right, it's right by the bookshop. <laughs> Looks like it's from Back to the Future Part 2. <laughs> so there are obviously people that don't live in L.A. that are just like, what the heck are you guys doing? But there will be some that are not in L.A. That, that's the bonus round. Um, okay. So nobody got that one except Jack's Exploration uh, or Jen's Exploration. All right, this is an easy one. Is that the one in Pasadena? Is that the Pasadena Playhouse? It's close, but <laughs> it's say not. You it's easy. <laughs> um, you know uh, Tim Robbins? Oh. Remember Tim Robbins? No, oh, the actor. The actor. Central. He was in yeah. a theater company. But it's um, the actor center or something. Good lord, I'm terrible. It's okay. I'm not. I don't mean to be shaming. It's just fun. We're just having fun. Here. <laughs> it doesn't mean like, anything. I've been to the play out. <laughs> this is the. Uh, I only see theater of note shows. What can I say? Yes, I you're just. A, you're a purist. <laughs> there we go. Jaxie's right. Actors gang. Actors gang. There it's we go. at the Ivy substation, I believe that they used to call it. I don't know. <laughs> Actors Gang, Jen's Floration. All right. This is fun. We're just the hosts. Don't even worry about it. We're the hosts. Um, what about this one? Yep. Miami Vice the Musical. <laughs> <laughs> close? It's definitely yep. close. I like the idea. Is there a Miami Vice musical? There should be. Uh, I'm just stalling here. <laughs> Help someone. Help. Okay, this one's downtown. Um, it is, uh, hmm, I don't know how to describe it really. It looks like a church. It does. It does but I don't want to give it away. <laughs> um, all right, yeah, here we go. Good. Jesus Saves Theater. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, we're just going to go for it. It is the East West Players. Oh, okay. There was a guest, The Noise that. Within, oh, which is a good guest. Right there. Right there. East West That's Players, cool. great theater company. Must check it out. Um, yeah. They do really wonderful work. I think it's one of the only equity theaters in town, you know? Yeah. Um, all right, next one. How about this one? It's in Burbank. Oh, oh that's, that's the Jim Gary Marshall. It's the Falcon well, and the Gary Marshall the Theater. I think and it's been it's renamed. Gary Marshall. Gary Marshall it is renamed. <laughs> I knew uh, this is Falcon, though. <laughs> <laughs> that was created by Gary Marshall, who did Happy Days and Laverne yeah. and Shirley and all the wonderful things. I actually on. auditioned for them once. They did didn't you? choose me, but I did audition, well, and Gary Marshall was in. 
the oh, audience. Really? And that felt he's, really amazing. He's super cool. He was super cool. Um, up with people. Here we go. Up with people. <laughs> um, this is great. I love this contest so far. How about this one? Where's Jaxi when I need her? And where's Jen Sploration? Like Mexican restaurant. It does. Is it, it that probably one used to be. Mexican restaurant? <laughs> um, I don't know, but you know, when when I went there last, it didn't look like this. Dan Wingard has the answer. I'm going to reveal it. Come on, Dan. I bet you have done rehearsals there before. Theater. Oh, Fountain. Oh, yes. That's right. You got it. Yes. You nailed it. I've heard all of these names, but well I've done, been in LA primarily in COVID times, so... I've the, seen, they're all online. They don't yeah. have building. The theaters all look like they used to be churches. Well, you know, <laughs> church is a form of theater, right? Mm -hmm. uh, they're La Quinta. Fountain. <laughs> Gensploration got it, too. Okay, moving on. How about this one? Yep, yeah, been there. You've been mm. there. You've been there, right? It's, it's on Sepulveda, right? It is. It's on Sepulveda. You got it. Oh, God. I've it's been not, there. I know it. It's not... <laughs> Mm. It's uh, it's based mm. on something written by Homer. Odyssey. <sighs> What'd you say? Waste your money when you need them. The Odyssey Theater. Uh, ah, that's a, Dan that's the, got it, yeah. of course. <laughs> I was like theater ensemble. It's a specific choice of words. I was like, I know which one. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Odyssey Theater. There it is. All right. This one. I can give you a clue. This that one's is... on Melrose. And oh. Nobody said it yet. The Simpsons. <laughs> Dan Wingard gets it again. He blushes again because he knows all of them. I'm going to give you. I'm going to give you a, a hint. Uh, Keanu Reeves never acted there. <laughs> but you'd think he would. You'd think he would have. I'm going to give the chat room one more moment. It's not the Groundlings. It's down the street from the Groundlings. Groundlings. Annie Potts is playing in the aftermath. In the I should just Google it really quickly. Yeah. <laughs> no Googling. Here it is. Jaxi. Jaxi nailed it. The Matrix, which is a ah. long-standing theater company in Los Angeles with a great reputation, just like theater. No. You're probably the worst people to be playing this game. The non keanu <laughs> It's okay. It's like you're the hosts. <laughs> so Matrix Theater. No, I, I'm, well... Let's see, the Keanu knot. I like that. <laughs> yeah, Dan got it as well. No, the Dan will get them all. Okay, so now let's see where we are in this thing. Cause Oh, here's a really difficult one. Great theater, though. The thing is, the theaters move around, and this one has been in a lot of different places. And this is currently, well, uh, before the pandemic, this is where it was. Matrix. Yeah, that is an awesome name for a theater. It's cool. It was before. It was named The Matrix before the movie, even. Mm. All right, I'm going to give you this one because this is tough, but it's a long-standing theater company in Los Angeles. Is anybody? Dan Wingard, Jen Sploration. This is over in Atwater Village. Currently. Oh! <laughs> Tip of tongue. Okay, here it goes. The MTS. Uh, oh, Echo... Well, you know, there's a couple different spaces in here, so this is a tough one. This is—I is don't know if this echo? is even fair. It's not the echo. Is it the Shakespeare? It's not the Shakespeare one because that's oh. Uh, last yeah, time I, I was there, I saw a play with Alina Phelan, who's also in theater of note on the board, I believe. Mm -hmm. It's a fantastic play, and it is. Well, then the I would have said the echo, and then if I'm wrong, then that—that's not what it is. Someone said, "Is it the set to the office?" <laughs> <laughs> I actually did a show uh, where they did The Office. Um, I did, uh, uh, what was it called? To Tell the Truth. And somebody pointed out to the parking lot, one of the PAs were like, look out there. That's the parking lot from The Office. And it was. Isn't that weird? Um, so this is uh, Open Fist Theater. You know, Open Fist? Know. Yeah. See, I've uh, heard of all these. I just... No, of course. Now visual. you know what they look like. Matter. Okay, this one's tough. This one's out in Venice. Oh. Get it? This one's been around for a long time. Um, I think Orson Bean was the one who established this actor. Um, no Googling. <laughs> Not Googling. <laughs> here, here it is. Here I'm it just is. staring into the distance. This is called the Pacific Resonance. Pacific Resonance. Yeah, Dan Wingard gets it again. Yeah, yeah. 
gets it again. All right, there's and only one know, more LA theater. The I think there's only one more. <laughs> yeah, didn't want to get the shirt. <laughs> what about this one? Good lord, no clue. It's a theater? That's a lovely building. Isn't it beautiful? It's downtown Los Angeles. Ooh, this has a lot like of a history bank. in it. A lot of plays have been performed here, uh, but not a lot of people know about it these days. Um, I'm going to let Dan or Jackson win, God, win it. Or, you know, I mean, a lot. We've been here longer than you all have. Let's face it. <laughs> we have had we have some history <laughs> in these things. And oh, noise within. It, you know, noise within is in Glendale. This one's downtown. Uh, Jack okay. does says the White House. Uh, Dan doesn't even know. Dan doesn't even. Oh, know. what? See? Is it? Uh, there's like a bank on the Universal Walk. It looks like it a looks bank. Like it does. It is the Los Angeles Theater Center, or also called the LATC. Um, wow. Yeah, there you go. It's pretty. Okay. Ah, oh, Center Theater Group. Let's That's specifically it, yeah. the, uh, oh, what's the one? It's not the Amundsen, it's the other one. It's the, it's named after a person. Very um, instrumental in Los Angeles <gasps> theater. I've there been to so many places. It's the Mark Taper Forum. Taper, there you go. Yeah, Mark thank Taper you, man. <laughs> All right, so like, now we're moving on it's not the to the next of. round, which is Coliseum. places. Coliseum. <laughs> That's the Coliseum <laughs> in Rome. All right, that was good. Um, now there's the Coliseum. This one, okay. The Globe. The Globe. The globe. Old there Globe. Go. That's in, in London, the Globe. No, I've not seen them do the theater. What about this one? This is in New York. Oh, that's the public. Public oh, theater. Yeah. See, yeah, the snobs know about the theaters outside of LA. <laughs> so I guess we know now. <laughs> what about this one? Chinese, Chinese man. That's not outside of That's not outside of LA. That's not that's outside of LA, yeah. That's around the corner from It's there. outside of the theater world, I suppose. Um, uh, yeah, so that's used to be called... Man's Chinese, Grandma's Chinese. Now it's called TCL. TCL. I don't know what TCL oh. stands for. Um, anyway, thanks for playing that. Uh, who won? I think, I think that Dan, Dan, Dan Wingard Wingo. won the t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> I think Dan Wingard wins. Dan Wingo. I'm going to be sending him a t-shirt for sure. Um, <laughs> all right. So now uh, we're just going to move on to the end of the show because we've reached the end of the show. Um, let's just go into this here and just wrap up.